Hello South Dolphins, welcome to today's edition of SES Rewind. Up first is the word of the day. Today's vocabulary word is disappointed. The, def- the definition of disappointed is to be sad or displeased. An example sentence is, my dad is disappointed because his car broke down. Next, let's hear the joke of the day. Hey, South Elementary, it's your instructional coach, Jenny Oakley here, and I have a joke for you. So, what is a snake's favorite subject? History. Wait a minute. Don't snakes eat bunnies. I'm out of here. Now for the weather report. Hello everyone! Today's forecast is a chance of rain and high of 50 degrees. So make sure you grab your umbrella and a jacket. Let's check out some special reports. Hey guys, it's Miss Hoffman. Now if you're wondering, Miss Hoffman, why do you have a plate with a blue water and a candle? Then you're ready for our science experiment. So I'm going to show you something really cool and then I'm going to explain how it happened. But first you need to know that if you want to do this science experiment at home yourself, then you have to ask your parent because it involves candles and those are not safe to use without a parent's permission. All right, let's see what happens. When I put a cup upside down over my candle, first I want you to pause and I want you to make a prediction. What do you think is going to happen? And then let's find out what actually happens. Do you see that? The water is going inside of the cup. And the candle went out. Do you see those bubbles? And all of that water that went inside the cup? Why do you think it did that? Let's take a closer look. Do you see how so much of that water got sucked up into the cup? Why did the candle go out? And why did the water go inside the cup? Okay, are you ready to hear how it happened? So, first thing, when the candle was burning inside of the cup, it was causing the air inside to get heated up. Now when air heats up, it expands. So it didn't have anywhere to go. So the air had to go outside of the cup. When the air was all leaving outside of the cup, that did two things. One, it caused a pressure change inside, and it also caused the candle to go out because fire needs oxygen to burn. So when the candle went out, it caused another change. The air inside the cup cooled down because there was no more fire burning. That caused the pressure to change even more. So the difference between the pressure inside the cup and outside the cup caused the water to get sucked up inside when that pressure changed. I hope that you guys found this interesting and I hope that you can try it at home, but safely with your parents' permission. Bye. Now it's time for the Pledge of Allegiance and the Dolphin Daily Pledge. Good morning, South Dolphins. I hope you're all doing well. I would like for you to join me in saying the pledge and for a moment of silence. So if everybody would please stand and put your right hand on your heart, we could say it together. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Today is a new day. I will act in a safe and healthy way. I will do the right thing and be polite. I will respect others and treat people right. I will take responsibility for me. Today I'll be the best I can be. Thanks for watching today's edition of SES Rewind. Have a great day of home learning. Be sure to follow our YouTube, Facebook, and Twitter pages for additional videos from staff at South Elementary School of Communications.